In this demo, we will look at how we can migrate Cisco ASA Remote Access VPN configuration to Cisco Secure Firewall Threat Defense using the Firewall Migration Tool. Log into the tool and begin by uploading your ASA configuration. Once the parsing is complete, we can see the different components that will be converted. And that includes RA VPN configuration with five connection profiles. Click on Next and provide details of the FMC to which the target FTD is registered and select the FTD for RAVPIN migration. The FMC version should be 7.2 or above and FTD should be 7.0 or above. The tool lists all the features that will be considered for migration, including the RAVPN configuration as well. Proceed with the parsing and once parsing is complete, the tool displays the summary of the different components that will be migrated. A more detailed version of that can be found in the pre-migration report which contains the list of the different components on ESA that will be migrated and how many of them. It also provides the list of unsupported configuration, configuration that will be partially migrated and configuration that will be ignored. Click on next and proceed with the migration process. In this demo, we will be focusing on RAVPN part of the configuration. Now, there are certain pre-migration activities that need to be completed when migrating RAVPN configuration. This includes creating trust points as PKI objects on the FMC. Additionally, all the required AnyConnect packages and AnyConnect profiles can be uploaded on the FMC in the PPN section. On the tool, all the RAVPN related configuration is found under the RAVPN tab of the Review and Validate section. The tool makes it very easy to upload profiles that are part of the RAVPN configuration, lets users update the authentication servers and local users. It lists all the address pool that are present in the ASA configuration and will be migrated to FMC. It displays and allows the user to update the group policy attribute. It displays the connection profiles for review and it also lets the user update the trust points that were previously uploaded onto the FMC, all from the same page. Once all the updates are complete, proceed with validating the configuration. Go through the validation summary and proceed with pushing the configuration onto FMC. This may take a little while. Once the migration is completed, the tool will display a summary of the different components pushed to the FMC and we can download the post migration report for additional details. It displays the number of access policies created. It shows the different features that are being migrated. The ACL optimization report is presented. Objects that are not referenced in any policies will be not migrated. It displays the remote access VPN policy created and the different tunnel groups that have been created as part of the RAVPIN policy. The same can be verified on the FMC that the RAVPIN policy has been created with the required connection profile and associated configurations.